All right, from eastern Guilford County to Wilkes County now in the western part of our coverage area where we have an air tag warning. A woman here is on high alert after finding someone placed one of these tracking devices on her car. She made that discovery two days ago, and ever since, she's been left with a lot of unsettling questions. Fox 8's Elijah Skipper, live now at the Wilkes County Sheriff's Office. Elijah, what did she tell you? Yeah, 24 year old Haley Walls tells me that she got a notification on her phone alerting her that an Apple Air tag had been tracking her location. Now, she traveled from work to her home all while being tracked. And what makes this more unsettling is that she has no idea how long. You just never think something like this is going to happen. Haley Walls has been searching for some sense of safety again. It says I'm 10 feet away from it. You don't know the intentions of this person and why this person targeted me out of everyone like everyone else. The 24 year old single mother's life revolves around work and taking care of her six month old baby. Two days ago, that routine was turned upside down when she received an alert on her phone saying an Apple AirTag had been tracking her every move. It also gives you another option to play sound to locate the AirTag, but it's so faint. You can hear it if you, you can literally only hear it from right here or underneath of the car. Despite that faint noise and days of searching the car from top to bottom, that AirTag has not been found. It even shows like where I stopped back there at the stop sign. They know when I come home, when I go to work. Um, so I think changing up your routine would be very smart if this ever happened to you. And for the person who did this, Walls has a simple message. I have no idea who this person is. I think they're crazy. They're psychotic and they definitely need to go get help. I would ask them like why they chose to put the air tag on my car and what their intentions are. Haley has filed a report here at the Wilkes County Sheriff's Office. The investigators asked her if she had any angry exes or enemies. She says that she has no idea who could have potentially done this. She says she's going to have her car lifted later today to hopefully find that air tag in Wilkes County. Elijah Skipper, Fox 8 News. Elijah, thank you.